Tommy, it's the resumption of league business and, and we got back in track last week with a, a good victory in the Cup. Yeah, we've got to build on it. Uh, when you lose a game, it's important that uh, you bounce back quickly. Um, and it was a good performance last week. Uh, you know, both teams made changes. Um, you know, what pleased me was the quality of our play. Um, you know, a little bit disappointed how we conceded a goal, but we can learn from that. Uh, and it, you know, obviously helps us going into this game because we've, we've started a, a win and run again and we want to continue that. The quality of the play, as you rightly mentioned, you gave some players the opportunity. Have they, they given you something to think about, not just in that game, but in training this week for your team? Yeah, I mean, I, I think um, with the squad that we've got, uh, when you make what was it, I think five or six changes last week, uh, some people look on it maybe that you're weakening the team. I didn't think we did, and, and the performance proved that. Um, we've tried to get two players for every position nearly, and with that comes a lot of competition. So, um, you know, the ones that um, have been doing well uh, and are in the team will know, you know, when they look at the performance last week, that they've got to keep doing well because there's people, uh, you know, ready to take their place. This is just one part of it, I suppose, <coughs> but having Ollie Shaw in the building and Scott Robinson back fit as well after the knock that he took against Inverness to give you just increased attacking options at the top end of the pitch? Yeah, I mean, it's it's no secret in the past that I've normally played two up. Um, you know, I was fortunate to have um, Steve McLean, who was really good at dropping in out of possession. Um, so, uh, Ollie and um, Scott trained together this week and looked really good. Uh, but Liam Poe was done extremely well in that 10 position as well for us. So we, we have options and uh, and competition. And it's um, that competition, I think, will drive everybody on to, to do better. And, and it, is, it is difficult for those not in the team. But, um, you know, I'll always be fair with players and um, always try and pick, you know, what I think is the best team for, for any given game. Roman Burrell was back in the building this week. Nice to see him back and getting some first touches in the pitch. Yeah, uh, brilliant. Uh, you know, Dylan McGowan's back as well. He had, um, you know, a, a, an issue where he had to isolate. Um, so uh, he's back in the building. But uh, Roman was a, a surprise. We got a message, I think, late on Sunday that he was going to be in on, on Monday. Um, so really pleased he's um, been able to step up the work that he on the, on the work that he had been doing at Middlesbrough and there's been no reaction uh, there's still things that he has to do before he can get into full training and when he does that obviously then that gives us you know even more, more options up top Morton were one of the, the busier teams towards the end of the window how different a team will they be to the one that we faced in the Premier Sports Cup I think I mean, if you look at the Premier Sports Cup, they made it they made it difficult for us. They're uh, quite a strong team, you know, strong at the back. Uh, they played with two strikers that day. Um, you know, they've got um, you know a bit of power and physicality about their play. They're well organised. Gus is a you know very experienced manager. I'm expecting another tough game. They brought in obviously Gavin Riley, who who, who knows the league. Um, you know, and and um, is a, a really good finisher. A uh, couple of young lads um, from from Newcastle, um, Tom Allen, um, and, and a defender they brought in from Newcastle. So it could be changed. The team could be changed. Um, you know, three or four positions from what we played um, in the Premier Sports. But um, again, we'll know that when we get the team tomorrow. We prepared for what their team, what we think their team will be. But I say every week, it's about us. It's about what we do.